News 13's Ashley Searles joins us live. And local accountants say taxes are a little more complicated this year, Ashley. That's right, Tammy. For a lot of folks filing this season, they are. That's because a number of laws have changed since last year, and the timing of some of the changes has not been ideal. It's the busiest week of the year for pretty much any accountant. Yes, this is Cody. But the thing is, this tax season has been even worse here in the mountains for most. Uh, we are seeing a tremendous increase in the number of extensions we're filing this year. Legislators passed an update to the Internal Revenue Code that went into effect just two weeks ago. The way the bill was written, it was put in with fuel tax which is a very controversial issue. The late changes have forced certain people, like some of those with mortgages, student loans, or IRAs, to refile. On top of that, the divide between federal and North Carolina gay marriage laws has created more paperwork this year in some cases. And then there's the Affordable Care Act, now in full swing, which gave some special credits this year and others, if you were late signing up, penalties. This year, I think several things came together because we have federal and North Carolina changing at the same time. At Asheville's Johnson Price Sprinkle accounting firm, staff say lawmakers in Raleigh have also made some really big changes recently, coming up with essentially their own much shorter list of deductions instead of staying in line with Washington's list like usual. It's definitely unique from any other year. Uh, there have been other years probably as difficult, but this had a lot more moving targets in it. Now, if you have any concerns that you may be in that portion of folks that has to refile their taxes this year since the law changed on March 31st, you can head to our website. We've put a link for you there to help you figure that out.